<clears throat> Didn't get any nothing up and everything around. Perfect. Ready? Yeah. Welcome back, guys. We're back with another video from the Pasture Inn. The Princess. And we're doing something a little different this time. Uh, there's no no racing, no challenges. No. <laughs> uh, but we'll go ahead and let you uh, introduce what we're going to be doing. Um, some of you may have heard of this, some of you may not have, but we got a box from Snack Crate. Um, we did pay with it, pay for it with our own money. It's not being sponsored. It's not being sent to us for a review. This is paid for with our own money. This is our own opinion. So, and we'll be doing this once a month. <laughs> And the thing is, is it's international, so we do not know where these snacks are coming from. It could be from anywhere around and, the world. And I guess there is a few from America as well, but mm -hmm. we don't know where this is coming from. We're going to find out just like you. We've had it for a few days, but and it's been killing me because I've been wanting to open it, and but we'll see where it's from. I have been a little snippy and kind of peeking on YouTube to see what the majority of people have gotten. So I have an idea, but I'm not sure. I mean, we won't really know until we open the box. I'm guessing Brazil. I'm guessing, what was it, South Africa? South Africa. South Africa. Yep. So. so are you wanting to open it? This is a movie. You forgot to introduce Ruth. Sorry. Here's Ruth. <laughs> and the tiara. I'd have it, I didn't put it on the last video, and I didn't have it on today, but I'll probably put it on on Friday. Yeah, you'll want to tune in Friday. Yeah. <laughs> we'll just say that. I'm a little scared for Friday. But you have to tune in to see what it is. Yes. There's just one piece of tape on the edge over there. So we're going to find out just like you. And uh, all we're going to do is just going to try this, review it, and see how it goes. Should we show it to them first? Yeah. All right, guys. We, we are going no to. Idea. Yeah, we don't know where it is. Literally just rub the tape on it. So we're going to. Oh. Is <laughs> it still falling out? Oh, that's just the snack crate. Germany. Secret. Germany. Oh, wow. Mm, that's okay. cool. So we got Germany. Mm -hmm. um, they, they always like to give you uh, some fun facts about uh, where it is. And, you know, there, I can do a couple of them real quick. Uh, if you want to tell them what else is in there right now. This is a little sticker. That's what fell out. A snack crate sticker. Uh, oh, okay. I know what that is. It's funny because one of my backgrounds and my heritage is German, and uh, I can the spetzel. It gives you a recipe how to make the spetzel, which is like a like a dough. Um, some people that are German and some people that like German food know what that is. It's like uh, the dough that they use for nifla, nifla soup, um, fried nifla. It's kind of like a little mini dumpling. So it's the best way I can describe it. So that's kind of there's some interesting facts like in this thing. One, in Germany, it's not against the law to escape from prison. <laughs> it states that it's human nature to want to be free, so prisoners have the right to escape jail. Mm. It's also illegal to run out of fuel. Well, on the Autobahn, you might be in trouble. On that one. You can be fined and have their license suspended for up to six months. He likes to play the game. How far can we go on the last? Well, it's on E. And despite its name, Chinese checkers, it was invented in Germany. That's pretty cool. So, you'll see a little thing here. And I like Chinese checkers. A little information sheet, which is kind of cool. And this tells us all the different little snacks that we'll be getting in there. And uh, as we bring out one by one, she'll introduce what they are, and then we'll go there. <laughs> I'll introduce it? Yep, you will. So, here we are. We're going to open and see how it goes. I may have German in my heritage, but I can't speak it. Well, so do I. You did too? Yeah. That was pretty cool. I know you have a lot of in your heritage, too. Okay. Here we go. Okay. What is that? You all see that? That is... <laughs> I'm going to butcher this name. <laughs> Nusper Bufris. Which I'm guessing is like puffed rice. Little bits of puffed corn that have a light fruity flavor as you munch. They will literally pop in your mouth as they hit your tongue. So maybe it's like... Like pop rocks? Like a puffy pop rock. Okay, well we'll give it a shot. We'll see how it goes. 
We'll give this a shot and see. Maybe we might like it. I don't know. Right. Let's put you some and then I'll do pour me some. All right. So this, what was this called again? The Nusper Puffries. Mm -hmm. Okay. So hopefully you saw that. Okay. I'm going to lay those over there so Ruth can have a little bit. <laughs> Let me get them in my hand now. So are you ready? It smells good. It smells pretty. Mm -hmm. Ready? Okay, here we go. That's different. Not what I expected. Mm -mm. They don't pop like pop or off. No. Mm -mm. And they don't pop or do anything. No. Um, if cereal could be flat, that would be a flat Freddy Poop. Fruity Pebbles. <laughs> Freddy Poobles. <laughs> Fruity Pebbles. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Um, it literally disintegrates in your mouth. It does. So, uh, I, I really don't... I mean, it's okay. But I don't know if I would eat a lot of that. Mm-mm. But, I don't know. What do you think? It's okay. It's okay? It's okay. So, there you go. Uh, the noose for a we will give Sorry. it half and half. If you like it, awesome. Sorry, oh. it's just not our... On a scale of one to ten, I'm thinking four. Two. Oh, I'm generous, <laughs> I guess. So, there we go. That's that's the number one. Ruth, do you like the noose for puffries? She doesn't like them either. Oh, yeah. Okay, so let's go to number two. All right, next one is it's, it's er, it's one. It says Ed Ednub Lochen. Ednub Classic. <laughs> it's a puff peanut snack that will make you kiss cheese doodles goodbye. I don't know. I like cheese doodles. I like cheese doodles. They are light and airy, which make them the perfect. Yeah, those other things were light and airy too, and they were just, they weren't that good. I need to drink water first. So. Alright, so let's give this a whirl. Okay. Oh. They smell really peanut buttery. Yeah, they do. It smells like a... I can see that or not. That smells like a... Uh, what they look like. Good peanut butter milkshake. Oh. So let's go to Whirl. Ready? I like these. These are good. It tastes to me like a roasted peanut. They smell better than they taste. Well. I don't know. I think they just lose some peanut flavor. Uh, they're not sweet. At all. No, it's like you, to me, it's like you take roasted peanuts and you um, put it in a food processor and turn it into peanut butter, but without the sugar. That's yeah. what these taste like. Yeah, I can see that. Mm -hmm. I like them. They're pretty good. They're okay. They're better than those poofery things. <laughs> so, so far, I think this is my favorite of the two. Mm -hmm. So, there we go. So we'll have to move on. How many things are in there anyways? Quite a few things. Mm -hmm. We bought the mid-range box. There's actually three three sizes of boxes, but we got the one right in the middle. Okay. These are like little gummies. Y'all can see that. Haribo Sour. Great. Vol sour Vol stuff. Volcano. Herbo Haribo Volcano Sour. Um, these gummies are exploding with intense flavor. Literally and physically. Yikes. Experience a burst of lava in every sour fruity bite. If you watch the video we've done about the lemons and all the sour, I'm not a fan of this. So I'm not looking forward to this at all. I'm kind of worried because it says sour and lava. Oh, let's go. I think I'll only be having one of these to start off. I think you should start with five. No. Not happening. Ooh, look at me. Oh, that's kind of cool looking on the inside. You, you did show it, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. The back of it's just white. 
Yeah, the inside looks pretty cool. It's very like squ little, very squishy. It's like a little volcano with love in it. Looks they smell nice. good. Ooh, they do. So there I guess two I'm different gonna... ones. This one's the blue one. It has like a little bit of purple. I guess I got a blue one and a green one. Hmm. So, oh well, we'll try them both same time. I'm gonna try one at, at once. Is that is that right? Very, very chewy. <laughs> very chewy. Oh, there's lava. Mm-hmm. Not bad. Mm-mm. That's good. Yeah. It's a little tart. As much as I cannot stand sour stuff, this isn't bad. No, they're really good. A little tart. But it goes away quick. Mm-hmm. Then you're back to the tough, chewy stuff again. Mm-hmm. It's really tough to chew. So, I don't know. Not bad. I don't think it's something I would buy, but it's not bad. I would buy it. I like it. That's okay. All right. <laughs> All right, next are going to be these. Can I see that? Okay. Can you see that? I'm just kidding. <laughs> Liveness Butter Kicks. Butter Kicks. I don't know. Mm. Anyways, it says it's a crisp biscuit with a rich buttery bite. Fun fact, they are famous for each having 52 teeth rimming the edge of each cookie. Okay. That's what it says. I think it's just the way the edges are. Like you take a fork and make your edges on stuff. There's a lady at our, at our old church. She'd be perfect for this. Yes. She's a natural born German. She'd be able to explain all this stuff and pronounce it properly. And my, uh, I'm sure my grandma would too. Yeah. So German folks, we apologize. We'll give it a, so this is more like a what, a cracker? Oops, I broke it. Crisp biscuit with a rich buttery bite. I think this is going to be like a cookie, because biscuit is usually a cookie. Okay. Do you want one whole one? No, I'll just take a half one. Okay. I'll show you all what these look like in... It's focused on the best of biscuit. Okay. okay. I'll just take that one. Just take that one? Yeah. The whole one? Okay. Oh, I thought this was a half one. Well, this one's kind of broke. No, this is fine. Okay. That's fine. It's smell like... Just like a, like a cookie. It smells like a cookie. Like a sugar cookie. Oh, so let's give it a shot. Not too sweet. But I like this. I like this a lot. Mm -hmm. This almost reminds me. You remember the the blue tin of cookies you get around Christmas time? Mm -hmm. The one that's plain? Mm -hmm. This is what this reminds me of. Mm -hmm. A flattened version of it. It does, doesn't it? But I like that. You know what it also reminds me of? And it's more of an Italian cookie. Or the Pizzelles. Mm, yeah, a little bit. Mm -hmm. oh, well, I think I'll take that one right there. <laughs> I like that. They're pretty good. Yeah, not bad. So we've got four down. Mm -hmm. See what else we got in there. Well, that's a little goodies in here. That one should be a little bit easier to announce. <laughs> Ballisto. Looks like it's a candy bar. And, oh, or maybe a cookie. A biscuit based snack consisting of a crisp cookie coated in a smooth layer of milk chocolate. Experience a burst of fruity delight in every bite. I don't know. <laughs> we'll see. We will see. We'll see how this goes. It says times two, so I guess that just means it's kind of like a twig. It has two in it. Sure, we'll try it. We'll figure it out. There's two in here. And they're kind of like a Twix. They look kind of like a Twix. Mm -hmm. You know, part of one? Yeah. I'll just take part of that. I'm going to just take a little piece. There's definitely some sort of nougat thing in there. Mm -hmm. I'll show you the inside looks like. I don't know if y'all can see that. That's it. Mm. Ready? Sure. Okay. There we go. Chocolate's good. It's a mix of a Twix and a fruitcake. Mm -hmm. That's what it is. Mm -hmm. um, it's not bad. Mind you, I don't like fruitcake. 
<laughs> but it is what it is. I mean, almost, I don't like chocolate, but that's pretty good. It almost reminds me of a, there's like a granola bar out there that has like the, <clears throat> the, I think it has a white chocolate coating and it has dried cranberries and things. That's what that reminds me of, except for milk chocolate. It's got a cocoa aftertaste. It hits you right at there at the end. It's got a different aftertaste. Yeah, it's 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 different. I don't know if it's cocoa or not. I don't know what it is, but it's different. Mm -hmm. It's not bad. So, okay. So that's one, two, three, four. That's five down. You want to pick one out? Mm, good grief, there's a lot of stuff down there. <laughs> now let's go with that one. I'll read that what that is. Okay. We'll show them what that is. I did not realize that was barbecue. It says knickknacks barbecue. Crunchy roasted peanuts coated in a salty, smoky barbecue flavor. They are a great on-the-go snack that can also go great with an ice cold beer or soda. That's what it actually says, or soda. <laughs> so I don't drink either, so water it is. I have a cup of coffee. I'm not sure that'll go with a cup of coffee, but so we'll see how it goes. Let's give it a whirl. All right. Mm. I didn't expect the barbecue part. Mm -mm. Okay. Ooh. Wow. <laughs> Those are strong. And I don't think it's a barbecue strong. I don't know, maybe, but it's not really strong. It's something. I don't know. Mm -hmm. We'll give it a whirl. Ready? All right. I've got four of them. I got five. Okay. <laughs> it's like the consistency of those Boston baked beans, but definitely not sweet. Mm -mm. I do get the, it's a smoky barbecue. Mm -hmm. I like them. You do? I like them a lot. Believe it or not. I don't know. But it's kind of like the consistency of the Boston baked beans. And it's got the hard, crunchy outer shell, and then you get the peanut in immediately below it. But it's different. I don't know. I think I'll have another. They're okay. Mm. It's different. That's for sure. Mm -hmm. But hey, it's all right. You want to pick another? No, go ahead. Right. Tell me what you got. You gonna read it? I don't think that one's on here. Really? I don't see it. Okay. Well, it's a yo yogurt. Yogurt? Yogurt. I like you very much. Oh, that's nice. So. I like you very much, too. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it's not on here. Okay. Well, cool. I think there's extra stuff in this box. There might be. Because according to this, we've got 11 snacks, and I think there's more than that in there. Because we've already had one, two, three, four, five, six. This is number seven. Ooh. And there's definitely more than four in there. Yeah. This comes with like little packages of the candy. So. Oh, kind of looks like a Kit Kat. Hmm. Looks kind of like a log. It does kind of look like a little log. You know the whole one? No. Half one? Sure. Well, there's more of that fruity stuff. There is more fruit stuff. It smells good on the inside, though. Mm -hmm. It does smell good. I just don't like the. No, it does smell I don't good. like the mixture of chocolate. And, I'm just not a big chocolate it's and fruit fruity. fan. There we go. Oh, it's a lot softer than I expected. Soft. I thought it was going to be kind of chewy mm -hmm. or uh, crunchy. Ooh. I like it. That's not bad. Mm -mm. It's like a chocolate covered strawberry. Mm -hmm. That's what it is. In Twix form. <laughs> hmm. Kit Kat form. Oh, yeah, that's what I meant. Kit Kat form. Mm. That's basically what it's it is. It's really good. It's very smooth. Mm -hmm. But once again, I'm not a fan of chocolate covered strawberries either. It's but that's not bad. The yogurt on the inside is like the. the What's your name? Pretzels. Yogurt pretzels. Yeah. yeah. Mm hmm. Yep, that's, that's true. It's really good. All right, let's go on to the next one. All right. Oh. 
Okay, I think I remember. So, yep. Kinder. Oh, I've heard of Kinder Bueno. I have too. I've heard of that. This candy got mad layers, man. That's what it says. <laughs> Beneath the milk chocolate coating. Great. More chocolate. There's a perfectly crisp shell encasing silky smooth hazelnut cream. Ooh. Isn't that like Nutella? Kind of. Isn't that what Nutella is? Hazelnut? So we'll give it a shot. And again, it's like a two-pack. It, uh, it looks like a Twix again. Hmm. And All individually packaged. Like individually packaged, aren't we even. Spent? But I've heard of Kinder Bueno. Mm -hmm. I've actually seen a commercial on it. I have too. So. Can't get it open. <laughs> there we go. And it comes in pieces that you can just break off. Well, kind of like a Carmelo bar. Mm -hmm. Okay. Smells good? Yeah, it does. Ready? Mm -hmm. Alright, let's try it. They're very light. Very light, very airy, but then that hazelnut just explodes. Very good. Very chocolatey. Very sweet. Mm hmm. I like that. That's not bad. Mm -mm. It's, it's very puffed up. I expect it to be more solid than that, but it's not. Mm -mm. Very, very light and airy. It's very light and airy. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I'm going to have another one of these crackers. Ooh, I like okay. those. I like these. Those are pretty good. Mm -hmm. Those are pretty good. Not bad. All right. What we got next? Is that, what's the first letter? Oh, knoppers, knoppers. I would say knoppers. Confectionery bars made up of several layers that complement each other in amazing ways. Some crunchy, some smooth. This snack has them all, it says. All right, so we'll give this a, give this knopper a shot. I don't think you got it. I don't think I did either. <laughs> there yeah, there's a lot of stuff in there. Mm -hmm. But this stuff is all native to Germany. And uh, next month we'll be getting another one we don't know where from. Um, so we're just going to find out like uh, like you all find out. That's a big cookie. It kind of looks like a s'more. Huh. See that? Kind of turn it flat too so they can see that. There you go. It's one side and then... Oh, is it different on each side? Mm-hmm. That's kind of like those sugar cookies. Mm-hmm. Like the little wafers. Like the like chocolate and wafers. strawberry and vanilla. Mm-hmm. All right, well. It's a little nicer. Is that it? Maybe. Was that all that was in the package? Was that thing right there? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, it was just that. Well, it sounds very crunchy. Very crunchy. Yeah. Hmm. Not really any smell to it. Mm -mm. So, all right, let's go shop. That's good. That's good. Mm-hmm. I kind of like a s'more. Don't say that because I don't like s'mores. I like s'mores. But it's very good. I like s'mores with peanut butter. All right. <clears throat> Get my crumbs out of the way here. It's okay. But so far, so good. Mm -hmm. There's only been a couple things I really didn't care for. But everything, you know, for the most part. You want to do those or the candy? The, those. These? Mm hmm. Okay. <laughs> These what? are the last gummy. Not nope, there. not on there. Let's see all what those are. Black gummy minis. So it's like little. There's one thing that's on here that I don't see in the bag. These bonbons. are like little fruit shaped um, gummies. See that? Yeah, I'm assuming these are like banana. Mm -hmm. So I'll take these. You I can don't. have the banana. I know you don't like those. I'm not a banana fan. Uh, I'll take the other banana. Okay, you take the banana. I don't know what that is. That one looks like a strawberry. That looks like a lemon. <laughs> Great, I got the <laughs> lemon. That one, looks, that one is a leaf. But I love banana flavoring, so hopefully that's like banana. Smell that. Hmm. That's different. Okay. I like that one. We'll All right. Out. 
figure it out. So which one are you going to eat first? The, the green one. I guess I'll get this like goofy lemon thing out of the way first. Okay. We'll keep this in chocolate from the other thing. That absolutely had no flavor. None whatsoever. It has kind of a lime flavor. I'm but I'm going to try these bananas. Hopefully it's got some banana flavor. They're all different. Mm. Very, very chewy. I'm going to try the one that looks like a strawberry. I mean, I know they're gummy bears, but... Or gummies. Mm -hmm. I don't care for those. They don't have a lot of flavor, but they're not bad. I don't care for them. Mm. So that's okay. We're not meant to like everything. No. It's okay. Which one? Save the candies for last, though. The candies? Hard okay. candies. And we got two of those little packages. Yeah. Okay. Do you have that one in there? Okay, I think so. I'll show y'all what it looks like. Hanuta. More crispy wafers. Mm -hmm. hey. Crisp wafers containing layers of delicious cream mixed together with freshly roasted aromatic hazelnuts and cocoa. Might kind of taste like the other one. Maybe. So we'll see how it goes. Mm -hmm. Maybe. I, I like these crisp wafer things, mm -hmm. but I like the old-fashioned uh, wafers like the chocolate and strawberry and vanilla. Strawberry was my favorite. And there, there's two of them in here like this. They're okay. prepackaged. They do give you some pretty good money worth here. Mm -hmm. I will admit that. And, uh, you know, your first one, they give you five bucks off, too. Mm -hmm. That's not a coupon code that we have or anything. No, it's not a coupon code we have. It's it's directly through Snack Creek. Okay. Show you all what that looks like. But, like I said, we'll be getting these uh, near the end of every month. And uh, we don't know where they're coming from. So, but... Uh, you, you was guessing what, South Africa, and I was guessing Brazil. Mm -hmm. So I guess technically you were closer. A little bit, yeah. So. Smell that hazelnut right off the bat. Ooh, that smells so good. That is a lot of hazelnut Ooh. smell. Okay. There we go. I'm ready. It's a lot denser mm -hmm. than the other one. Mm-hmm. That's for sure. I like it. It's not bad. Concern I'm not a hazelnut fan, but it's pretty good. Mm -hmm. oh, we're gonna mess over here. That's okay. <laughs> we'll have the mate clean it up later. <laughs> yeah. Why don't you get a pay raise, right? <laughs> I'm kidding. Is this one on there? I don't believe so. What's mm. it called again? Snack that. Snack that. No, there is no more snack more, that on there. More, more cooking snack. Cooking. Cooking. Oh no. Oh, oh no. Y'all can see that. Well, I can't say I don't know because you wouldn't eat the when, when we lived in North Dakota, cooking was a big thing up there. I love cooking. Huge thing among especially Germans. I mean, because mm -hmm. it's it is German. Mm -hmm. And uh, when we lived up there, I I just do not like cooked fruit. And they kept trying to get me to try the, what was it, cottage the cheese? cottage cheese one. It's not like cottage cheese that you buy in the store in no. the tub. It's a dry cottage cheese. So. Ooh. You might like this. Maybe. Y'all can see that. It's like a marble. It looks yeah. like a marble Like cake. a marble cake. Mm -hmm. Like a marble pound cake. So we can just split it. Not really any smell to it. The cooking I'm used to is more like a pastry. Like yeah, this is not like, like, like a like a pie with custard and um, fruit. This that's is not like the cooking that's, that's very popular in North Dakota. Mm -mm. This is different. Okay, we'll try it. Okay. Kind of like a marble cake. Yeah, just like a marble cake. Mm -hmm. Nothing really. It's dry. Yeah. It's very dry. I think I'll have a cup of. Drink my I mean, it's it's pretty good flavor. I mean, it's just it's just a regular pound cake with swirl in it. Betsy approves. It's good with coffee. But yeah, it, it's dry. But I'm gonna finish it still. Mm -hmm. hmm. That's a lot of stuff. Oh, okay. So do we have one more thing? Kinda. <laughs> <clears throat> These are some hard candies. Mm -hmm. They're not on here. No, it's empty. 
totally. So what we got, you can see it better than I can. Does it have flavors on it? No. It's a guess. But they all are a certain brand. I'll take this one. I can see those. Little candies. I'll show you under close. I know I'm going to butcher this. <laughs> but it's a hoge brosse? Bros? Brosse? I'll say brouse. Brouse, maybe? Brouse. I don't know. You know, there's a girl we went to high school with. She also lived in Germany for a while. We, we could have asked her to do this. Yeah. She probably knows. What? So, I don't know. We'll give it a shot, though. All right. What one did you get? I don't know. You got a red one? No, it's orange. not red. It's like an orange. Oh, well, then I'll try the yellow. Please don't be sour. That's all I ask. It kind of looks like there's something in the middle of it. See that? Mm-hmm. So, we'll try it. You're trying yellow? If I'm guessing one's going to be sour, it's going to be yours. Probably. All right. Should be all the way in there, maybe. I don't know if y'all can see that little line in the middle. So, mm -hmm. here we go. We'll try it. That's oh. really good. <laughs> it's sour. It's really good. It's really sour. It's not real sour. I like it. <laughs> I like it. I'm just not a sour fan anymore. I don't know why. I used <laughs> to like it, but I don't care much for it. <laughs> but that's okay. So, there you got it. That's right. All right, guys. Welcome back. Sorry about that. I cut off in midstream, but mm -hmm. you really didn't miss much. We'd already caught, tried everything. We just want to let you know this is our first snack crate. Um, it was, it was from Germany. I do like it because they give us some facts and geographic demographic stuff uh, about the country uh explanation of what's in the box and a recipe and a recipe so um yeah what do you think i liked it i'm looking forward then to the next box yeah so uh, we should be getting these uh, once a month near the end of the month and then we'll try to work them in see what we're gonna do so what was your favorite uh thing of everything my favorite was uh, kinder bueno all of it. Like I said, I'm almost positive we've seen commercials on TV. I think today. we have. I really like those. Those are my favorite. My favorite has got to be the Hunada. I, I like it because it was dense. Uh, it wasn't very airy. I mean, it was had some substance to it. My so, least favorite was the first this, thing that we tried. Yeah. Mine too. These these were just not good. Mm -mm. Um, even though this was really sour, this was, I just didn't much care for. Um, it just kind of seems to disappear. Yeah. When you put it in your mouth. And not much flavor. Not much flavor. Like Fruity Pebbles gone bad. It's it's a watered down Fruity Pebbles. Yeah. Is all it is. Mm -hmm. So. You know. And during that time when you didn't know that the camera had kicked off, I finished off my little lemon drop. That's what I'm going to call it. And it actually took me back to childhood because I remember eating this as a kid. Probably something my great grandma may have handed me. Um, and she was full German. And it the inside, once you <clears throat> open, once you bit into it mm -hmm. it was like a fizzy kind of piece of candy it was weird was it sour i don't know how else to describe it it was a little more tart than the actual candy so i'm glad i didn't make it to the center line it, it, i loved it it was really good it just took me back to to that time it was really nice so but there's also and this is actually a sticker that was in the box mm -hmm. for snack crate um but uh yeah check them out uh like i said it's nothing we can offer but it's a discount they'll give you five bucks off your first box and then it's just a reoccurring every month shipment mm -hmm. uh, that they give you once a month. So where will next month be from? We don't know. We won't know until <laughs> we open it in front of you. Yep. So, uh, guys, we appreciate it. And hope you enjoyed everything. Yeah, thank you for for watching. And uh, don't forget to click that like button, like this video, and don't forget to subscribe and share. Please subscribe. And check us out on Facebook. Like our Facebook page and follow us on Instagram. And if you got any suggestions of things like this or challenges... Mm -hmm. Anything you'd like to see, drop them down in the comments mm -hmm. so that we can see, because uh, we want to, we just want to bring smiles to people's faces. Yep. We read all the comments. So. Yep. We appreciate each and every one of you. So, yep. anything else? No, that's it. All right. So, from the pastor and the princess, we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. Is it good? Mm.